Hey, what's going on guys? It's Lachlan here and welcome to a brand new series guys. This is how to Minecraft. Now for those of you guys who have been following me on social media for the past couple of weeks, this is it. This is that series that I've been hyping up for a while now, as well as the other participants to the series. Now, it is going to be a 1.8 SMP. That's right, guys. This is my first ever SMP that I've done on YouTube. I'm very, very much excited for this, and I hope you guys are too. Now, this is a teaser episode for this weekend. It's going to be episode one, where all the... Phase 1 members are going to be doing the episodes today, so you'll of course see everybody's perspective of their first episode coming out around the same time today, and then next weekend it starts. Streams, episodes, the whole shebang, so get excited, and of course if you guys already are, be sure to smash that like button. Let's try to go for 5,000 likes for a brand new SMP, and I'm sure this is going to be one hell of an adventure, so let's get right into it. So this is the Spawn Town for how to Minecraft, which is a nice little spawn town. Um, we can't build in it yet, we can't um, break anything in it yet, but uh, it looks like uh, the thunder actually, sorry, thunder or lightning? No, thunder is the sound of lightning. Lightning is the actual physical object with Ali A just sitting up there chilling. Um, looks like he did it, but no, he didn't. Uh, we, I just came on the server last night, it was fine, but they came, and I came on today and uh, it was struck by lightning. So this is um, gonna be fixed hopefully, but uh, it'll turn into a shop later. And the way we want this series to work is it's gonna progress as we go. It's going to slowly grow as a city and there'll be shops and stuff like that available later when um, a version for plugins can be available for 1.8. But as for now, it is a straight vanilla series and it will progress as the series progresses. So it's going to be a really cool series and of course, it looks like Ali... I wonder which one's Ali A's house, man. Just, uh, he's got a massive A in front of his house. That's going to be his. So we'll just walk out of spawn and you can see I already have two deaths. Now this was just me going uh, across the spawn and I uh, accidentally ran out of hunger so many times so I just kill myself so those two deaths doesn't really count I gotta try and uh, you know get them I can't really get them erased I don't think yet because uh, Robert Dub Flob is away but of course if you guys didn't see the invitations this is of course hosted by myself Mr. Wolfles Rob uh, Preston and Vic and Mitch so we guys are uh, pretty much doing um, all the hosting although I will be honest Rob is doing his fair share um, everyone's fair share, to be honest. He's doing a lot of the management and stuff like that, so big thanks to Rob for doing all the setup, which, of course, is also done with the Arkham Network, who are hosting the server for us, and all that jazz who will be producing plugins in the future, stuff like that. And, uh, yeah, so, Vanilla Minecraft. Now, I said a while back that I was really, really excited because back in the day when I first played Minecraft, all I did was play on an SMP server. Now, um... I got banned from that server several times, actually, uh, but it was really, really fun. I used to, and, and guess why I got banned? Because I took killing to a whole new level. I was the assassin of the server, and I played it on an Australian server as well. Um, something I guess I'll never ever get to do again unless I, um, I don't know, do something different. Because I'm playing at 200 ping right now, so it might be a little different, but I also played on an American server as well, and it was fine for the most part, so shouldn't be too difficult. But uh, the way I did it was... I would just go around killing everybody. I, I wouldn't give a damn. I, I like you had diamond armor. I'd get the invis, the strength, the speed, the regen. I'd pop all four of them, run into your house, find a little crack with an ender pearl, and just throw it right down in. And that's how I would do it. Um, and since then, I haven't really done any like massive PvP stuff. I went straight into Pixelmon as I started my channel, and I haven't done any. Um, yeah, I haven't done any real SMP PvP. I mean, obviously I do the PvP mini games every now and then. Sometimes modded, of course. And uh, yeah, I'm just looking to get right into it. So this episode is going to go for around 20 minutes. Uh, it's a nice little teaser episode. We're hopefully going to get the basics of my house started. Now, by basics, I mean literally a crafting table, a door, and maybe a, an L for a lot. I don't want to copy Ali A, but I like how he's got his A in front of his house. So what, should, what kind of like signature should I get uh, um, on my house? I don't know. I was thinking... A little L? I, I think a, a nice L would go well. I don't want to do CBD because that's like too much, but uh, there's a sheep up here. I could use your wolf for a bed, buddy. Um, what's he? I uh, missed Alia's uh, question. Do you want a present, Lucky? Uh, sure. Um, I don't know what he's saying, but uh, as well, the face cam. You guys can probably already tell. Oh, 1.8. They drop mutton now. Oh, that's so sick. 
Um, <laughs> yeah, so as you guys can probably tell, the face cam. Now, I'm hoping that this series will be a 100% face cam series, like I said in my 500k vlog. A lot of my new series are going to be all face cam. And uh, I just think it adds, like, another dynamic to the uh, the gameplay. I think it definitely uh, makes the video more entertaining to watch. So, I definitely think I'll try and do some, uh, some, some, some face cam on all these. Now, definitely for the streams. And how it's going to work for the most part is I'm going to be streaming at the same time. And then I'm going to be uploading that stream. Um, which is something I really want to try out. Um, so that's going to be really, really interesting as well. Now give me these sheeps. Alright, I didn't want these sheeps. Now should I make my house out of white wood? Or just the traditional um, brown wood? And I'm not sure how far away I want to go from spawn as well. Um, I'm thinking not too far. But I definitely want to try and get some distance. Now the first 30 days is a free for all. So there is PvP. But you have to give that stuff back I believe. Unless you agree otherwise and want to do some sort of like... Uh, death pit sort of uh, battle, I guess you can uh, agree like, all right, my diamond sword for your diamond sword and whoever wins gets the diamond swords. Um, but you both have to agree to it, of course. There is gonna be like, I guess it's a little bit of a peaceful 30 days, I guess you'd say. Um, but then after that, I'm bringing out my invis, I'm going hashtag blur mode, I'm getting my strength, my speed, my diamond enchanted sword. And that's the thing I love about SMP, is that you try and grind out the best like enchantment levels and stuff like that. Like That's what I remember when I think of like SMP Minecraft, because that's all I did was try and grind out those... I, and this was back in the day when you'd have to just like smash a, uh, a, a mob spawner for about an hour to get level 30. You'd hit it up, you'd put your diamond sword in a, an enchant table, cross your fingers, and... And half the time you'd end up with like Bane of Arthropods 4 and you'd be just crying and then you do it again and rinse and repeat um, so that's that's uh, that's my whole SMP story I guess um, now where should I go I'm wondering because right now I'm just um, gathering food but I think that's dumb so I should at least like build some uh, oh first achievement awesome I think I'll build some wooden tools for now just get some uh, nice little resources going now I think little lizard told me but I don't really want to spoil the episode but uh, they said they had a pretty good first episode resource wise so I am hoping to get uh, some, I don't know, like a, I don't really know what I want. I want some want some cool stuff. I didn't tell Ali where I was, by the way. I'm all bad. Um, yeah, I am. Yeah, I am, soz. <laughs> and we can't TP as of yet, but there are rules that are going to be updated as we go. Um, I would try to get the rest of the rules, but I don't think there is a huge amount of rules. I'm just trying to see if it's there. No, it's not there. Um, but uh, yeah, so just uh, really excited. Oh, and another thing. I didn't actually do this first, but... I'm going to, this is, this is my teaser episode, I'm going to be using this texture pack, which isn't uh, a one that I would like to use. I want you guys to suggest a texture pack for this series. Um, now, I was thinking a Sfax would go down really well. Um, yeah, we'd really like to try some Sfax out, if you guys have um, any Sfax books. I know there's several 1.8 sort of like texture packs, so let me know what uh, I should do. Sfax or something. The present will have to wait. Alright, Ali. I would like to be mayor of this little subsection village, if I could be. Um... Now, I wonder... Oh, peace out. Okay, peace out, Allie. Um, his house is just over there. I don't want to build it too close to his. Um, but I also don't want to, like, just walk around the, the server for the next 30 minutes and watch you guys... And let you guys watch me just walk around. So, I want to, you know, get some stuff done. I would like to grab some pumpkins, though. Resource gathering is very important. All right. We've got the bed going, so that's at least something. Um, we've got, like, three wool, I think. Yep, we have three wool to build a bed, so that's something, at least. I think we'll just go over this direction, find... A decent um, setup place. Now, it might not be my actual house because I want to build a. Now, it, we did this in dinos, but uh, in my SMP that I used to play like three. And this, yeah, that was literally three, four years ago. Um, I had a ravine house with a couple of my quote unquote clan buddies. We, we'd make a, a ravine house. And we did this in dinos, but uh, I'm wondering if I should do it again in this because it was just something we did. We'd have this nice little setup. And uh, it was really cool. But I'm thinking this mountain over here looks very, very cool. So we'll go over to the mountain. And I think mountain houses are definitely going to be a popular choice. But actually, when I think about it, in my first ever SMP, I did have a mountain house. Um, so I might go for a mountain house. And it's just funny. You, you go to the mountain now, raw. I should probably take some screenshots of it now. I'm actually going to do that. Because it's it's really just a progress thing. I should take a screenshot of uh, our house before we start building, and then like every like couple of days. I'll probably only do the first one because I'll forget, but uh, it's just one of those things. You just you leave it for a while, and you just keep building and adding on to it, and the next minute it doesn't look anything like what you've started with. Um, there's a random dirt block there for good luck, so awesome. Um, we already have some vines up going to the tree, so we're going to get up this tree. Oh, there's a nice cave as well. This is looking pretty legit. I'm hoping no one else is trying to claim this land. So let's just go to the top, uh, get out our crafting tables and stuff, and uh, get everything ready to get started on our adventure. Now, I'm not timing this episode, so it might be a little longer than 20 minutes. We'll have to see. 
Um, hopefully not too long. I have to eat some of this mutton though so I don't die. Um, so how much does mutton give? It gets a full heart. So I think that's just like raw beef um, for the most part. There's a big hole down there. So I'll just grab uh, at least three of these for a stone pick. And I actually might grab enough for a furnace as well. Just go straight for it and uh, get some stuff done really. Because we've just been trying to find a good place for the most part this episode. Can I mine? Can I mine coal? I think I can, yeah. Yeah, I can just. It's very, very long though. I'll just grab a couple pieces while I make the furnace and the stone pickaxe at the same time. I just, I always hate making a wooden pickaxe, and I gotta throw out this wooden sword as well at one stage. It's just annoying to have for the most part. Um, and I'd like to go to bed because I hate nighttime. It's really bad just gameplay wise because it makes you guys unable to see as much, of course, watching um, at home. Let me just see the contrast between my face cam and. Uh, that's, it seems alright. I put a green border around the face cam today, um, if you guys didn't know. It's going to be like the how to Minecraft sort of uh, face cam border. And the blue is going to be Crazy Craft, and the Pokeball is going to be Pixelmon when I do it in the future, if you guys saw my stream the other day. But I am really liking this tree, this this uh, this mountain house. I'm loving it. Da -da 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 -da. That's like the Macca's thing. Um, anyway, uh, let's get that crafting table out. I sort of left it behind before. Um, let's get it out. I know I just did a full 360. I'm really, gl I'm really, really excited to get some Sfax on here, though. I haven't changed my texture packs in so long. Um, I was almost going to do Sfax for my Dino series, but it didn't seem to go down too well. Um, it made my NVIDIA drivers crash a lot, which obviously is a problem I get every now and then. Um, not, I'm recording with XSplit right now. I don't get it as much if I record with XSplit, so let's hope for the best in that situation. But uh, let's make some stone tools as well as some fern eyes. I'm so excited for this series, you have no idea, the hype is just so real, and it's going to be awesome because, like, we're all going to be streaming at, like, around the same time, so there'll be, like, seven of us on the server at one time, and we'll all be streaming, and we'll all just be trying to, like, get new resources, get new gear, get, oh, it's just going to be amazing, I hope you guys are just as excited as I am, because that just makes the series even better if you guys enjoy it, because it's, oh, just too much hype, now let's see what Cooked Mutton does, there's three, three, uh, meat sticks, that's not too bad, not a bad resource to get at all. Um, so I'll probably just uh, go full, uh, you know, just get rid of all the, um, get rid of all the trees here, clear it up a little bit uh, to start building my house. Now that's another thing, house designs. I was probably um, gonna go look for some house designs on Planet Minecraft and just try to copy them now, I, I, like trace them for example, um, because I really want to pride myself on having a really cool house this series. Um, so I was, and. and <laughs> And I'm saying that because I don't want to say I built the house. So what I was going to do is I was going to get um, one of the uh, Planet Minecraft uh, cool house designs on the side. And then on a stream, I'd like trace it, building it. And I think it'd be really, really hype and exciting. Uh, just get like a nice little, you know, legit house with some features. Um, they're good. It's going to be practical as well. It's going to have like really good uh, like setups for crafting, smelting, all that jazz. This is a really tall tree. I'm going to keep that tree. That's going to be a special tree. It's going to be the tree of life. Always going to have a tree of life. Um, okay, and we'll grab a couple of these. Got to need that oxygen that uh, the leaves provide. Um, so that is all of that meat produced, I believe. So we'll cook the next lot. Got a decent amount of meat to start the series, which is nice and dandy. I was like, can we please spawn in steak to start this off? Because I obviously had that hunger problem. So I just I was like, oh, I'll kill myself. Um, but uh, it sort of backfired. Um, anyway, we'll probably get like a, a, a lake up here for my sugar cane. Because I definitely knew... That new, I definitely know that at one stage I will want that sugar cane to grow stuff. But uh, I think I might work on evening out the land next. I think I'll, yeah, I'll cut it from about there just to even it out a little bit and get a nice little flat surface. So it might take a while to actually do all that though. Um, but uh, we'll see. Hopefully I've got enough time to go for a short little mine today. And then I might have to wrap up episode one of How to Minecraft. Like I said, the series is about... Um, teaching you guys, of course, the basics of Minecraft. We, of course, will be learning them um, as well. But, of course, you guys are like, we already know how to play Minecraft. I know everyone knows how to play Minecraft. But that's just like, it's sort of just like the series name. We don't know how we came up with it. It was just like a nice little name. Because, like, at the same time, we'll be providing an entertaining experience of, like, things you can do in Minecraft. But, of course, you'll probably learn a couple things along the way if you didn't know already. But there's a majority of you will be like, yeah, I, I know my Minecraft. But, you know, it's going to be fun and entertaining. So, um, I'm really looking forward to it. You know, you guys might not know that 200 ping while playing Minecraft, you can do some really dodgy stuff. Like the other day I learned that uh, while playing wireless parkour, I had an advantage because it took a while for the wireless potion effects to actually get to me. Um, so I could use that to my advantage and cheat. Still lost, but, um, <laughs> today I learned, you know what I mean? Uh, okay, let's grab our steak, put in the raw beef. 
And let's get started with our bed. So, we've got our three pieces of wool here. I would like to keep the other white pieces of wool just in case I want to use them for something. So, I'll use all three types for now. And there's our bed. So, we'll put our bed here. We're just going to clean out this land first. Um, I think we, yeah, we have one more piece of cobblestone. Awesome. We'll just grab that and wipe this bit out here. We're going to have a lot of saplings. Not really going to need them for anything yet. We try and grab some seeds as we go, though. For, we don't really need food at this moment. Uh, or, like, sort of bread. We don't need that. We've got uh, steak, which is really, really good. That's why I guess it was nice and handy to go out and uh, go grab some meat at the start of the episode. Punching them all to death. Um, and then, moving on, the hostile mobs aren't spawning at the moment. Now, I don't know if that's a, a thing that's going to be long-term, but for now, they're not spawning. Uh, I think that's, like I said, one of those progressive things. They'll come in, uh, I think they might come in next week, actually, for the teaser episode. You meant to get, like, just your basic things started, and, uh, yeah, just good to go for the most part. Now, I'm not sure how long it's going to take to clear all this out. I don't know if I'll get it done this episode. It just takes a while. I um, wish I had, like, an iron pick or an uh, iron shovel or something. But uh, just clear it out, get a nice little flat land. And uh, be good to go. I guess I'll just clear out this little bit here and then I'll be done with it. I'm pretty sure the grass, uh, the dirt with grass on top of it is like harder to, you know, mine than the actual dirt, which is a little bit of a bummer. Um, so this will look messy, but I need to claim my land. So I should at least put a sign up and say, um, this is my house. Now, of course, I need some names for this house. Um, on Crazy Craft, we have the Salty Shore. On Pixamon, we have the Lake of Rage. What is this place going to be, is my question to you guys. Um, really, really look... I, I mean, obviously, we need to build the house first. That's sort of... Um, I should probably face it the other way. But uh, we'll just call it Lachlan's Mountain for now. This is a temporary name. Um, all right. <laughs> Lachlan's Mountain House. Hopefully, that all works in one. Yes, it is. Okay, that's just temporary. I don't, I don't like the name Mountain House. It's just so people know if they go past my house in the series. Uh, I probably should put a big L there as well. Uh, but anyway, let's go do some mining for the last five minutes that we have remaining in this episode. And uh, yeah, just get started on our adventure. Um, I wish I was some vines that I could just grab onto. We've got our stakes and all that jazz. So we shouldn't be, shouldn't be, um, shouldn't be too hard to get through this place. Yes, we do have this. Alrighty, also do we have a stone, no, we don't have a stone uh, sword yet, but that's fine. We'll just grab some coal. That coal, there's like two pieces of coal went a long way, by the way. They did their job for the most part. Now, in 1.8, enchanting uses lapis. This is going to be interesting to see how we're going to use that. Um, now, I think it just works. You have to you have to have it when you're enchanting now. I'm not too sure. I haven't really read up on my 1.8 uh, features, but uh, there's a lot. I remember like every time Minecraft would update back in the good old days, it was like, oh my god, new content. What are we going to do? And uh, it was it was sick. I remember like anvils came in. I remember when the Ender Dragon came in. That was just like next level. That was just like everybody look out. The Ender Dragon's in town and everyone would like race to go fight it. And then they'd get the egg and they put the egg in the house. That's what we're going to try and do. I know how to grab it. You can grab it with pistons or I believe there is somewhere with a torch as well. Um... I think torch is a way, yeah, because it falls down. Yeah, you put underneath it and you put a torch. Torch is definitely a viable method as well. Um, but uh, piston was what we did back in the day. And everyone would just try to grab out their pistons and uh, try to do it at once. Like, we'd all team kill the ender dragon. And then uh, everyone would just, like, grab out their pistons, try to throw redstone torches on the ground. And then half the time, the guy who actually set up the trap didn't even get it because there was just one guy trying to just run in and snipe the dragon egg just as it came out. It was hilarious. Um... <laughs> Just some good old SMP memories, I tell you. All right, let's grab this. That should be a decent amount of coal for now. No iron coming out yet, though, which is a little bit of a bummer. I mean, this little cave was here, but nothing too much has come of it yet. Um, there's just coal on the walls, chickens everywhere. Got some decent amount of mob spawning. That's what I like. All these mods I play these days give a stupid amount or not stupid or not enough amount of uh, spawns. Like, for example, my... Uh, the Crazy Craft series, the mobs are just not right. The don't spawn correctly or something. I'm lagging for some reason. That's not cool. I'm getting 30 frames. Um, oh, I know why, maybe. Video options. No, max frame rate is enabled. That's really weird. I'm getting like 180 now. It's it's weird. It's when I look at something, I get bad frames. Um, now I'm going 40, 40, 30, 80, 100. That's weird. I look, if I look at the sky, it's fine. But, oh well. Uh, I'll leave that turf block there. Oh, I didn't take that screenshot, did I? Ugh, and I already just sort of destroyed the land. Um, well, I guess this is like, it's hard to grab, but there's day one. Okay, so I've already, you know, gone through with it. I wish I did it before that. I could probably grab a still of the actual video, I guess. But uh, I can't find any caves around. 
um, here. So I'm not sure if I should... Just, I'll go for one more cave mine. Looks like we got one over here. And then I'll definitely go for a wrap. Hopefully it's not a huge cave. Um, we might have to end it down in the cave, actually. Oh, there's a pig! Actually, that reminds me. Let's make some torchies. Torchy torchies. Alrighty. Let's make some torchies. Piggy, what are you doing down here? There's no mobs down here, so you shouldn't be uh, scared. There's no mobs anywhere. I don't think... Unless we get hit a spawner, of course. In which case, then we'll hit, run into some mobs. And that'll be very, very scary. See, under the caves, I'm getting like... I'm getting 600 frames right now. Which is scaring me, because I hate it when it does that. Because it makes the video too hard to compress. So we'll move that down to 120. And uh, that should be nice and dandy for us. Won't go above 120, which is above 60, I believe. You can't actually tell. Your eyes can only register um, 60 frame rates or something. Above that, your, yeah, your eyes can't tell unless you want to try and put it into slow-mo. Um, so it makes it easier to put it into slow-mo, of course. But I render in 30 FPS, which, of course, is what uh, YouTube will accept. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> but there's a decent amount of iron down here, so I'm not, uh, not all salty at all. There's a real decent amount of iron. We could probably get uh, a full iron set for this episode. Now, there is no set home yet, so I can't TP back home, which is something I really, really want uh, in this series. But uh, like I said, no plugins in 1.8 yet, so I'll have to find my own way home every time. And I can't do slash top to get out of a, a, a mine. I have to, you know, walk back out, find my way out. It's uh, it's going to be real intense. And I remember just like uh, back in the day when I didn't have that, it was, uh, it was you know, it was, it was a travel to get out of here. Alrighty, let's uh, get some stone. Okay, what have we got in here? It's sort of like Battlelome-esque. Battlelome-esque. And it looks like we've pretty much explored the most of this cave. I'm really scared. I really should have timed this episode. We might go a little bit above 20 minutes, but that's just more for you guys. Um, so, And I also, my control button is now my sprint button, I remember now, so I don't need to press that uh, double tap. Um, so I'm really hyped about that, because I hate pressing the double tap button. And that is the extent of this cave. So we'll just grab this, go back up to our house, and I guess we'll give it a log out then. Um, so... Episode 1 of How To Minecraft, getting off pretty good, got some iron to make a full set of iron, probably iron tools as well, and uh, on our way to start things going next episode. Now, I'm not sure how the shops will work in the town, I don't know if they're, I think they're like AI run, so we don't run the shops, um, but we can go in and buy stuff from the shops if we choose to. Um, and I want you guys to sort of like place bets, like who do you think will be the first to kill an ender dragon? Who do you think will be the first to kill the wither? Who do you think will be the first to get uh, full diamond. I don't know, it's just, like, there's little mini achievements along the way. Not chapels. Oh, not chapels. To build not chapels in a fight, that's really... PvP has changed so much since I've done this. It's going to be really, really interesting. Alright, there is actually another half of this cave there, but uh, it doesn't seem there's... You know, there's, some, there's some extra stuff in there. We'll just grab this iron, and then we'll definitely get out of here. Um, of course, it's like a seven-block saw, so it's going to take a while with this stone pick. Uh, so let's just grab what we can get. Come on, come on, come on. We've got to... Go, 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 go. I'm actually in before 30 minute episode, and that's what happens half the time when I'm just having so much fun. It just it just takes up all the time, and I'm like, oh, well, wrecked. Um, they'll see that cobblestone, and they'll be like, oh, okay, someone's been here. I am, like, quite far away from spawn, but I'm not exactly just, like, ages away, so it shouldn't be too bad. Um, I wish I could... Can I climb that vine? I can. Awesome. <laughs> I didn't know you could do that if it wasn't actually attached to the block. So let's just go up to my house. I'm going to have to find a better way to get up my house. I'm going to have to build some construction ladders or something because it's really annoying. you got to climb up the back of the mountain and then you got to climb up. But uh, looking around, there's some floating islands over here I could probably connect to as well if I really wanted to. They would be really interesting, actually, some floating islands. It's a flower island over there as well. Damn. But uh, anyways, guys, I guess we'll give this episode a wrap up right there. I hope you guys did enjoy episode one of How To Minecraft. If you guys did, be sure to smash that like button below. Like I said, 5,000 likes would be amazing if we could reach that goal. I am very much excited for the series, and I hope you guys are too. And yeah, I will see you next weekend for a brand new episode of How To Minecraft, the official launch. See you guys then.